How's it going everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Next up tonight, I got IC going with four of the Nightfall Pin Club boxes. Thanks for the order, IC. Appreciate it. Let's get these going, man. Four of them. Let's not waste any time and get right to them. Appreciate it, man. Bunch of the Nightfall Pin Club boxes. Here we go. Great choice on these. Uh, look for some more of these to hit the site sometime tomorrow. We have very few of these left at this point, but we can still get some more listed up for you guys. I can take some out of storefront as well. If they're still sitting over there. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yeah, Robert, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> First world problems, man. All right, I see. I'm gonna try to figure out the most efficient way for opening these. I'm gonna try by slicing them all open. Maybe that's the way. Let's see if this saves some time here. I really don't know. I can't figure it out with these. <laughs> what the fastest way is. So maybe this will work. Now I don't have to pick up the knife at all anymore. Slice them all right away. Uh, the fastest way without ripping the uh, single pack, that is. Because that single pack, I'm just not going to rip. I know I could make it faster. Uh, if I rip this single pack, like I said, I'm just not doing that. Not ripping uh, <laughs> not a pack of cards with one pack or one card in it. It's just not a good idea, ever. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Appreciate it. Rip this over. Oh, definitely, yeah. It's going to have way better hit rates, Tyler. Not even comparable. Not even comparable. You might end up with 20 hits on a really good Brilliant Stars box. All right, that is quite the start. Headless Horseman Hollow right off the rip. Very nice, man. Congrats, I see. Hollow Headless. Um, hmm. Nah, we'll still do all these right away as well. Slice that. Slice that. All right, so here we go. Pin for you, the Headless Horseman pin. Um... Let me just grab a basket right away as well for all this stuff. All these pins and whatnot. Yep, saw your message as well, I see. I can get any of the alternate art pins uh, specially packaged up as well. Make a note of that. Few full it. Have to put like a mag tag on it. <laughs> Let's few full it. Wow, what a start, man. Mothman Hollow. Next one up. Congrats. You love to see that. Mothman Hollow. Beautiful start here. Mothman Pin. Go, I see. Pin Club pack here for you. Wood Devil of Coup Country there. Nice. Next up, Adam Ackler, sealed promo, Adam Ackler pin, pins can just go left right away I guess, and nice, another wood devil of cool country there for you. Another Wood Devil of Coup Country sealed promo this time. There you go, sealed promo. Pop open the pin. Yeah, no, these are just not a. <laughs> you gotta cut these. <clears throat> there it is. Beautiful Wood Devil of Coup Country. Yeah, that's the only problem with um, getting Japanese boxes from overseas, Robert, is they do take so dang long. So dang long. Nice crazy curve, bald mountain, beautiful. Yep, Tyler just said it. Yep. US sellers are definitely the way to go for all Japanese on eBay. If that's uh, where you like to shop for stuff, yeah, you have to find the US sellers. I agree with that. I think I've said that in the past a few times as well, of course. Um, just with Japanese cards and sealed products. Um, it's going to be a little bit more expensive, but that's going to get it there so much faster. Beautiful. Ingrid Cole. Yeah, we do also have them on the website. Yep, exactly. Sealed promo. Nice. 
exactly. Like I said, I am full tonight, but uh, some more orders, of course, available for tomorrow night and Monday night as well. All personals Monday night. And then we also group break those two products as well, Starbirth and VMAX Climax. We do group break those as well. Some uh, fun ways to get in on those two products that are kind of featuring a lot of the cards that are going to be in Brilliant Stars. Most of them actually are featured in those sets. Beautiful Adam Ackler pin. Oops, sorry. Nice Adam Ackler. It's going to be the sealed promo as well. They're super nice quality. Yep. Super nice quality. Incredible quality. Um, Ingrid Cold. Very nice. Keep these going. Next one up. Few fold it this time. I see sealed promo there for you. Few fold it. Also got the beautiful few fold it pin. Nice. Looking for some alternate arts here. Good luck. It's going to be Momo. Very nice. Momo card for you. <laughs> right, man. <laughs> Next one here. Keep it going. Adam Ackler there from the uh, black and yellow pack. Nice. And sealed promo. Going to be the crazy critter again. Beautiful. And a nice crazy critter pin as well. Nice. Come on. There it is. Crazy critter bald mounts. Nice. And yeah, empty on that one. Already did that, of course. Next one. Yeah, that's not too bad at all, Tyler. That's better than I would expect. Better than I would expect for sure. Nice wood devil a coup country. Certainly better than I would expect. That's awesome, Tyler. Pin again, Wood Devil of Coup Country. Pin Club promo pack. Wood Devil of Coup Country, he keeps coming up now. There he is again. Another one. Last one. Yeah, sometimes print lines on certain cards specifically, they can be a problem. Um, but yeah, overall, you're correct on that. Notice there's certain cards that have some printing... Uh, line issue specifically beautiful another one <laughs> wood devil of Koo country so many at the end sealed promo of course and the last pin club pack come on alt let's close it out i see nice grabbing a mothman hollow at the end beautiful that'll do the trick two mothmans and i have this horseman in that one very nice good ending there man move these pins quick Next one, good luck, man, on the pin collection. Pin club collection. Here is the sticker. Slice that. Uh, let me get these all opened up for you. Like one stack. Here we go. Let me uh, slice them all open again at the start. Keep going then through all of the pin club boxes for you, I see. Keep going, guys. Good luck, I see. Another uh, stack of them. Pin Club. Starting out Wood Devil of Koo Country. We are on a run of these guys. Holy cow. Another Wood Devil of Koo Country coming out. There he is again. Nice red ghost there. Beautiful. Beautiful. 
That is correct, mister. That is correct. They grade extremely tough. Super tough. Like, crazy tough, man. Man, it's nuts how hard they uh, grade their cards and stuff. It really is crazy. Ooh, had the horseman pin. You know what that means. The promo as well. Congrats. Beautiful hollow headless. Ooh, uh, crazy critter of Bald Mountain. Nice. Yeah, that's what I mean. They do grade super tough. So if you do have like a 9.5 or 10 or something like that, really, really good stuff. <laughs> that's funny, Chris. Ooh, we got the alternate art. T. Kettler. Very nice. Congrats on that. <laughs> See, that's the thing, Chris. I Yeah, he doesn't trust me. Just do it on my own. Nice alt art, T. Kettler. There we go, I see. Beautiful. That will also have the alternate art pin in here now. Should, at least. Let's uh, make sure. Yes, sir. Alternate art pin, I see. Perfect. Set this one off to the side, and yeah, I'll mark it up. Make sure it gets welly protected up for you. Beautiful, man. First alt art pin. Congrats there, T. Kettler. Very nice. First one coming out. Momo there, nice. Beautiful. To be fair, Chris, it's just these boxes that always give me uh, some troubles. <laughs> They're not that easy to slice. I don't know why. They don't uh, just like pop open. Like they should at least. Nice red ghost. Congrats on the uh, alt art there. <laughs> red ghost pin. <laughs> Doubtful, Chris. Doubtful. <laughs> I sense some upcoming training. Ah, there he is. Had this horseman again. Beautiful hollow. Congrats, I see. <laughs> nice one there. Yeah, a lot of people have been trying out uh, CGC recently and stuff like that. A lot of people have been trying it out. 100%. What's up, Jeremal? Kinderhook blob there. Beautiful. And the sealed promo. Nice. Keep going, I see. Personally, I have not sent any cards there, but I do respect the fact that if you fold it there, they do grade their cards so intensely and so tough. So you do have like a high grade, a 9.5 or even somehow a 10. Uh, you do know that your card is in good condition, that's for sure. Um, no doubt about that. And yeah, that is something that could end up, you know, working out in the future as well. I like I like what Chris said though as well about the CGC there. Crazy Critter of Bald Mountain pin, promo, pin club. The thing I always worry about with these smaller grading companies though is if a company like PSA, nice poltergeist there, a company like PSA goes ahead and, um, you know, releases a cheaper grading option. You know, PSA cuts in a $25 tier or something like that. Are people still going to want to send their cards to CGC instead of a company like PSA? Where the um, face value of like a PSA 10 or 9 might be higher than like a CGC 9 or even a CGC 9.5 and stuff like that. Uh, so that's, that's the tough part in my opinion. Where you have to make that decision if it's worth it or not. Beautiful red ghost. Nice one there. Nice, Chris. Yeah, very, very good for comics in that way. You are correct on that. Poltergeist. Beautiful. But like I said, who knows when PSA is going to come back? Who knows? Keep going, I see. Exactly, man. Exactly, Tyler. You know, why not see how it goes? No reason to uh, not try something out like that. You can always just test out your experience. Wood Devil of Coon Country. Beautiful. Pin. Nice. Promo. Few folded there. 
big like ding on the few folded. Yeah, what the heck? Yeah, that's wild. Few folded. Never seen that before. Keep going here. Appreciate the order I see. Slide this out here. Nice Imikuk there for you, man. Sealed promo as well. Nice Imikuk. Keep going. Pin Club Pack. Adam Ackler now. Coming out of the black and yellow Pin Club Pack. Close out the uh, box here. Good luck. Or uh, display, I should say. Close out the display. Alright, started out with the crazy critter of Bald Mountain. Beautiful. Sealed promo as well. And the beautiful pin club pack with the red ghost. Nice. On to the next one here, man. Good luck. Let's do it for you. Fix my garbage quick. Next one, mystery collection box. That's what I mean. Yeah, exactly. And chances are, Chris, those cards are going to be like in pretty much the exact same condition or somewhat close to, you know. I agree with that, Ryan, especially like a Beckett 10, yeah. Especially a Beckett 10. Um, when you think about how long Beckett's been around for and stuff like that. How tough it is to get a black label. But um, yeah, unfortunately, don't know if it's ever gonna change, man. Don't know if it's ever going to change with the PSA 10s being the king there. It's, it's a tough one. A lot of people do enjoy those other companies that um, put together those high quality slabs with great subgrades. You can even see how the corners, the edges, the surface, and the centering graded on the card. Um, so that's uh, a lot of the reason why a lot of people enjoy those other companies besides PSA. All sliced open on the pin club boxes. Good luck, I see. SGC a lot for soccer. Nice. Beautiful. Headless Horseman again. Congrats. Nice sealed promo, I see. Headless Horseman. Go ahead and uh, pop open the pin club. Uh, Headless Horseman here. Let's see what we got for you. Beautiful. Nice one, man. Keep going on this. Yeah, that's what I mean. I don't, yeah. I don't think it's ever going to change because of the reputation that they've already built up for those, like, sports cards and stuff like that that they grade. 100%, exactly. You said it. Ooh, nice. We've got another hollow. T. Kettler. There we go. Non-alternate art this time. On the T. Kettler hollow. Very cool, I see. There you go, man. Nice one. Sweet hollow to get. Beautiful T. Kettler. Yeah, definitely, Chris. That is also... That's a whole nother thing, but yeah. <laughs> that's a whole nother problem, but yep. You said it. I'll keep going here. T. Kettler, that was a whole box of T. Kettlers for you. Congrats. Hollows everywhere. Very nice. There you go. The T. Kettler. Nice stuff, man. <clears throat> Nice, nice stuff. Nothing much for you tonight, Joshua? Sorry, man. Sorry. Hopefully, uh, exactly, you can turn it around tomorrow night. You said it there. Hopefully, you uh, crush it, Joshua, on some of those personals at home that you're ripping through. If you are ripping through those. Kinderhook Blob. Promo. Get onto the pin club pack. <clears throat> All too well. Crazy Critter of Bald Mountain. And that's the crazy thing, Joshua. You can have a full night here of group breaks, whereas that could be just a single spot in that break <laughs> um, on sports that could last about 15 minutes or whatever. Ooh, already cracked that, of course. Keep going. 
Here we go. Finally, a Momo pin showing up, it looks like. Nice. <laughs> I can't leave stuff sealed, he says. <laughs> nice. There it is. The Momo pin. So sick looking. Extra high quality pins here. Move a bunch of these again. Sealed Momo. Beautiful. <laughs> For how long, I don't know. I have one as well, Joshua. I'm, I'm not opening it, though. I refuse. I refuse. I'd rather stare at the brown box. It's one of the only situations where I'd rather stare at the brown box. <clears throat> Few fold it there, not hollow. Yeah, true. Exactly, Chris. It always depends on your intentions with the card. If you just want to collect it, if you're looking to get the most value out of it. And those are always things that you have to consider when you're making the decision if you want to grade stuff like that. Exactly. All right, all right. Get the Adam Ackler out. There he is. Nice Adam Ackler. Beautiful looking pin. Sealed promo. Out of the pin club pack. Nice, Joshua. Nice. Give me a cuck there. Nice one. Yeah, very much looking forward to the release day and stuff. Very much looking forward to it. Keep doing that. It's habit. <laughs> They're all sliced open already. Keep doing it, though. All right. Here we go. And appreciate it, guys. Seeing a bunch of group break spots coming in for tomorrow. So thank you very much for that. Crazy Critter of Bald Mounts in there. Sealed promo as well. I can drop a link here for the break schedule if you want to check out um, all the group breaks that we do have going on tomorrow night, guys, starting at 6 p.m. Eastern. Link is in chat where you can uh, purchase up the spots for tomorrow night. <laughs> Chris, Momo. <laughs> Not quite Chris, but close. <laughs> That's just me being forgetful. Um, forgetting to use my head. Holter, guys, come on out. There we go. <laughs> You're, you're onto something, though. <laughs> Special tool training, he says. There it is. The Poltergeist pin now. Very sick one. Promo to match it. There goes the Mountain of Sealed promos. Been working on it. All right, there we go. And the pin club pack. Good luck here. <laughs> nice. Wood Devil of Koo Country. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, the safety scissors. I'm pretty sure I could definitely still slice a card with the safety uh, the safety scissors. I definitely could. Definitely could still slice up a card. No doubt. Um, <laughs> but that being said, I don't know how well the safety scissors would work on uh, these here packs. <laughs> we need you on the channel, he says. Poltergeist there. Another one. Yeah, I hope to think I would never... Uh, Slice myself. That would not be too good. Hopefully just slice the packs. Nice. Another crazy critter of Bald Mountain. Beautiful. Come on, I see. Hunting some alt arts here at the end. We got one for you so far. Let's see if we can grab another here to close it out. Good luck. Nice one. Wood Devil of Koo Country. Beautiful. In there for you, I see. Sealed promo to match it. And the pin club pack. Good luck. Red Ghost. Beautiful. Nice Red Ghost. Last one. Even cuck there. Uh, pin again. Sealed promo. And a pair of, or uh, one more pin club pack, and then we'll get on to the last of your uh, remaining sealed cases. Adam Ackler, non-hollow. That was a slower one. Let's uh, make up for it here with the last one. Let's do it. Mystery collection box. Appreciate it. Uh, maybe not. Was it in chat? Oh, I see it now. With Kamigawa, though, how rare are the old school throwback cards? Uh, send me a picture quick, Joshua. I don't know which one you're talking about. Ah, oh, I didn't pop the sticker fully. There it is. 
Send me a picture. I feel like you're talking about the Phyrexian cards, maybe? I don't know which one you're talking about, though. You're talking about the Phyrexian. They're tough hits. They're pretty dang valuable. Keep this going. Maybe Chris's message as well, then. Yeah, that's just not even fun, Chris. That is... That's bad. Straight up bad. Nothing else you can even say. But, yeah, no joke. You do have to always uh, be careful and stuff like that. Speaking of being careful, as I pick uh, tape off of a knife blade. <laughs> Speaking of being careful. <laughs> I think he's talking about the Phyrexian cards. I'm not too sure, though. Uh, Nick. Pretty sure. He's going to send me a Discord message. Nice, I'll look at it quick. <laughs> Chris. <laughs> to be fair, that had to happen sooner or later. <laughs> it was uh it was coming up. <laughs> You're messing with me now. Yeah, a little bit, definitely. Definitely. Alright, last two slice them open. Yeah, I got you. You're all good, Nick. <laughs> no problem at all. Um, here you go. Then let me look at Joshua's message. Nah, I do try to be very careful, though. No joke there. Look at this. Oh, so those are just going to be like the inserts at the back of the pack. Uh, they're not necessarily like rare at all, Joshua. Um, they're kind of just like randomly inserted, to be honest not necessarily like rare in any way it's kind of just like a cool throwback good question i see what you're talking about now i see what you are talking about <laughs> wait what daniel <laughs> what florida to alaska to kansas holy cow you could have picked him up on the way when you were uh driving around trucking what in the world, Daniel? Holy cow. That's craziness. Nice crazy crit of Bald Mountain and a beautiful promo card to match that one. <laughs> Safety glasses, he says. <laughs> oh, man. Give a cuck there. Yeah, that's actually crazy, Daniel. That's actually crazy. one out here. That's wild. I would have been as well. Honestly, I would have been extremely worried. I'm sorry you even had to go through that stress. It sounds like maybe they arrived now, I think. Another crazy critter promo as well. Yeah, I want to know the company as well. Expose them. Who's the company? Expose them, please. <laughs> there we go. Kinderhook blob for IC. going nice they did show up today well that's at least uh reassuring a little bit <laughs> a little bit reassuring usps it's wild that is wild crazy critter of bald mountain beautiful sealed promo as well yep correct yeah man my uh my dad has worked for usps for i mean i don't know 15 years or something maybe more than that a little over um Momo, very cool. Nice, sounds good, Daniel. Um, and yeah, he said that a lot of the higher-up management and uh, the employees that work there in general now, it's just not quite the same as it was a handful of years ago. Um, unfortunately. So it's not the first time we've heard a crazy USPS story, and I'm sure it's not going to be the last either. Like Joshua said there. <laughs> it typically is them when we hear these crazy things. It's so wild, though. <laughs> All right, it's going to be the few folded pin. Seal the promo for you, I see. Pin club pack has a Mothman. Very nice. 
Back to some hollow action. Congrats. Nice moth. Mothman, excuse me. Beautiful. Congrats on that one there. Great card to land. Alright, good luck. Keep going. Grabbing up another Wood Devil of Coop Country. Sealed. Wow, back to back now. How about that? Back to back, Mothman, Full Hollows. Congratulations, I see. I'd like to see as many of these as possible. <laughs> as many as possible. Congrats, man. Package I sent a customer arrived to completely ripped open in half. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's a problem. It's definitely a problem, Joshua. That's ridiculous. And then it's ridiculous because then you have to deal with that with your customer and stuff. And that can be a huge pain for you. Nice headless horseman. And a lot of it is just completely out of your control. Beautiful pin. That means you got the sealed promo. This has been a good pin club display, I see. Heating up on the last one. Let's see an alt art in here in, as well. Come on. Red Ghost. Love to see that for you. That would make it a really good one. Got another hollow. We're staying hot right now. T. Kettler, congrats. <laughs> Randy. <laughs> you said this sounds ridiculous, but I'm actually not shocked. <laughs> Fair, Randy. I guess I'm not either, honestly. Like, it's crazy, it's a crazy story, but it's not that surprising to hear of these things still um, continuing to happen. <laughs> Should have been a return to sender. Send what? <laughs> nice uh, non-hollow there. And there you go, there's that uh, pin as well. The T. Kettler pin. Very cool. All right, keep going. Ah, did it already. <laughs> Yeah, that's just so unfortunate though, Joshua. Shouldn't even have to really get to that point ever. Nice red ghost. Yeah, it's unfortunate that you do have to take those losses in the business because of something like that. Red ghost. Pin club. Pack here. Two boxes remaining on the pin club rip I see. Another red ghost. That was a red ghost box there. Two left. Thank you again for the order. Kinderhook Blob coming out now. Sweet one again, man. Kinderhook Blob. <laughs> yeah. Fair. Nice one there. You do get to uh, claim that in that way. But sure. Not uh, not any other really good positives there. And another hollow is Headless Horseman. Congrats, man. Another hollow. This has been a awesome pin club awesome one all right last one <laughs> kinder hook blob close it out hey i feel you i feel you carl what's up man hope you're having a good night uh wednesday carl it will hit the website and then anything you order up wednesday carl rips on friday so yeah we're getting closer we are getting closer kinder hook blob Last one on the pin club pack. Close this out. <laughs> Nothing, I just used it again when I had already cracked open the seal. <laughs> Chris is just giving me a hard time. Nice non-hollow. Beautiful IC. That was sweet. Had an alternate art T. Kettler. Lots of Mothmans, Headless Horsemans. Um, and then a lot of other beautiful hits as well. Congrats, man. Do appreciate that IC. We'll get those all uh, protected up and sent right out to you, man. Thank you again.